If you've got kids, chances are you've experienced this. And it's a very simple tool. Now when they're installed, typically they have a something like this that the screw goes into and it holds it in the sheetrock. But in this case, to fix it, all we need to do is pop, buy some toggle bolts. And what they are, I'll go ahead and open it. These are available at most hardware stores, any hardware stores really. It's a very long screw and it seats into this piece of metal, which is spring loaded. So the wall will hold, this will hold itself against the wall. So let's get started. Now hopefully the holes in your wall are still small enough that you can use the toggle bolt. But if you have a huge gaping hole, you're going to have to do a repair on the sheetrock first. I'm not going to be showing you that in this video. But here's the back of the toilet paper holder. And this is the same idea behind the shower rod. If you have a shower a towel hanger rod, then it will have a metal plate and the metal plate just fits right inside here and this metal plate is mounted to the walls. So we're going to go ahead and take the toggle bolt and put the toggle bolt inside like this and then we'll take the nut and thread it on So we're going to thread the bolt on just a little bit so that there's a little bit leading out of the nut. We're going to stick the whole thing inside the wall like this. And then you'll hear it spring back open. And so now it's secure. Now it's just a matter of taking a screwdriver and tightening it. Now you can just tighten it by hand for a while. And you want to make sure that you're pulling the uh, bolt against the wall as you tighten it, otherwise it will just be free spinning. Okay, we have that one secure. That one's maybe a little more. Okay, now we have our second one. This hole's a bit bigger, but it'll still work just fine. Now, you want to make sure that this is aligned properly in the right direction to the, to the base. So this needs to be this way. So make sure that the screws where it catches are aligned so that you don't have to rearrange this. So pop it in. Okay, you can hear it spring back. And then it's just a matter of tightening. Okay, we have that secured as well. Let's straighten it out a little bit. Okay, so the next step is to attach this. Now, on the base of this somewhere is going to be a little screw, and this type uh, is a flathead. Sometimes it's a hex shaped, but we've just got a flat, uh, flathead screw that tightens this onto the mounted bracket. So we're gonna go ahead and put it on and make sure it's aligned. So I'll put the screw underneath so that you don't see it. So it'll go on this one. So I'm just loosening it up so that the pin that holds it in place will fit right on. Okay, I got that. And now the next one. over the top. That's how you're supposed to do it, right? <laughs> so anyway, I hope that helps. And uh, be sure to tell your kids that this is not uh, cool to hang on. It's going to rip out. So hopefully uh, that helps. Let me know if you have any questions, comments, and subscribe if you want more how-to videos. Thanks for watching.